Today is Flag Day, and while patriotism isn't very popular, we've been asked by one of our heroes to share this message. Welcome back to the RV Odd Couple. My name is John. And I'm Mercedes, and we RV pursuing freedom, independence, and adventure. Because life is so short, and we have a very close friend, one of our heroes, Chris Heisler with the Honor Flag Network. And Chris has reached out to us and asked us if we could send a message delivered from him to the RV Odd Squad for support. The Honor Flag Network honors fallen heroes using a flag that flew over the rubble in 9-11. The Honor Flag Network honors fallen heroes, first responders, military personnel, regardless of race, religion, creed, or any of that. We're asking the RV Odd Squad to listen to Chris's message and to follow their conscience. Hey folks, Chris here with the U.S. Honor Flag, and what an honor and privilege it is to bring a message to you with the RV Odd Couple. Some great friends of ours, great supporters, um, so they gave me an opportunity to share a quick message with you folks. Do you know the honor flag is an American flag that since 9-11 has been traveling all over the nation to honor those who made the ultimate sacrifice in law enforcement and fire, our nation's military and first responders all over the nation. A single flag that has actually traveled millions of miles, honored thousands of heroes, even on the last space shuttle and aboard the International Space Station. So our mission is to honor, educate, and inspire. And as you can imagine, right now is a very difficult time, not just for the Honor Network and the Honor Flag, but for police officers and firefighters that are serving selflessly without any hesitation all across the nation. Now, patriotism isn't really popular right now, but the spirit of the U.S. Honor Flag will continue to move, as it's called, to honor those who've made the ultimate sacrifice. So I'm asking for your help. Uh, we need your support. I'm in Michigan right now. I'll be heading to California to honor a uh, sheriff deputy that was ambushed as a result of the protesting that's been going on. Now, I think that we are at the tip of the iceberg when it comes to situations like this um, in California, all over the nation, maybe in your state, in your neighborhood. Um, I hope that it doesn't come to that, um, but our mission doesn't stop. Criminals don't take breaks, and police officers don't stop answering 911 calls. So, uh, and for firefighters, the same thing. You know, last year we actually did a firefighter's funeral for a firefighter, if you can imagine, that was actually shot and killed. So, uh, this is a changing environment that we're in. Uh, it's dangerous, uh, a lot of hostile places that we're going to, but we will continue to do this. It's not gonna stop us. We need your support though to keep these wheels moving. Cindy and I don't get paid doing this. Our nonprofit, The Honor Network, is a, uh, upstanding nonprofit that's uh, registered with the IRS and GuideStar. Uh, so we, crown, we call, <laughs> cross every T and dot every I uh, to make sure that um, money is being spent wisely to do what we need to do to get where we need to go to honor those who deserve it. So um, if you can, if you're able to support us, you can use our link, uh, support the honor flag and what we're trying to do. And thanks so much uh, to the RV Odd Couple and to all the uh, odd squad members that are out there uh, for your support um, and if there's anything we can do uh, to come to your community with our mission to educate and inspire we'd love to come visit some of your schools uh, come to your community and share the story of this national treasure thank you today is flag day and the delusion that supporting first responders equates to supporting racism or that supporting black Americans equates to hating the police has to be smashed. We are all like passengers on a ship liner. Our survival depends on our ability to all work together and we cannot allow a few bad apples to poison the ship or even worse, we cannot stand back and stay quiet. We must stand together in order to create a more perfect union. So we share this message to you because the delusion that you can only support one side or the other has to be smashed. Has to be smashed guys. We're in this together. With the pandemic and now the riots that are going on, the Honor Flag Network is really struggling for support guys. Please consider sending money to the Honor Flag Network. If you're called to help, we're providing the information in the description and tagged in the comments below. And in the next video, we're going to share about how we met Chris and how we first came to know about the work that he and Cindy do with the Honor Flag Network.